Hello and welcome. Uh, oh. Stand up. Hello and welcome. I'm going to show you how you can command your troops in Arma 2 using my voice profile on uh, from the program Back Builder. Uh, you'll uh, see a link in the description. Uh, we'll be going through the normal team and slightly on the high command stuff. That stuff. So uh, the bene benefits of using this profile is that you basically are faster uh, using uh, voice command in addition to the keys than just using the keys. Uh, in this profile you can basically do anything with voice commands but it's you're supposed to be able to do some voice command in conjunction with keys like a mouse scroll or uh, or similar so um, to give you a short intro before I just give you a general uh, view of the profile um, what you're seeing now is basically a training mission which is in the profile uh, zip file uh, which you can play in Arma 2 uh, on this training mission you can get a lot of additional help in the notes where basically as you can see the command menu is down here with all the commands in the correct order and you have a legend with basically yeah, what voice commands and uh, this is a link icon which basically means that any voice command on this list for example return to formation plus return to formation means that you can say uh, say uh, all teams return to formation or team red green etc return to formation or individual soldiers 1 to 12 return to formation for example 9 return to formation and you have all those commands you can do in the voice profile on the notes to do which is kinda useful um, uh, there are multiple ways you can get to uh, the end result you want you can uh, use all teams or team X basically team red green etc or uh, 1 to 12 um, uh, you can also for example say select team red and then issue a command so for example if you're uh, if you're uh, in a rush and you basically are supposed to say one target enemy but you get a you get something happens so you just say one you can still say target men enemy after that because you can select stuff and then give the command as well as doing a direct command as you can see here and that's the difference between these two you can say advance now but if you haven't selected anyone that won't do anything but if you have selected people and you say advance now you, then that command will work but you can say for example four advance now and you will have a direct command okay you basically you can go through the list and look at the orders I won't go into any specifics but I'll just do a bunch of commands while I'm playing basically uh, sorry for my computer isn't isn't that great with fraps so there might be a few slowdowns so uh, apart from that you also have training missions in the radio menu which is zero zero uh, you can turn mus music on and off just to uh, familiarize you with having music playing in the background while you give orders because when you're using headphones which I recommend um, you don't have to wait for the units to be finished talking and stuff to give new commands um, also you have to keep in mind if you're not using headphones that a lot of the commands are uh, are uh, similar to what the player says in game so if you say um, return to formation for example 
the the player you are playing this guy he might say it and <laughs> the and him saying it through the speakers and into your mic might trigger the order again so keep that in mind so i recommend the uh, um, recommend the uh, headphones uh, so you have a few different options there. Uh, VAC training is basically a short training program where you're told to do the commands. Okay, so here we go. Uh, I have a toggle key for uh, the profile on and off, and that's the insert key. So that's why you haven't seen any action from the profile while I've been talking a lot. Track off. Track off. Just uh, using track IR, which I recommend for helicopters. Track off. Track off. Two, three, four. Sign Team Red. Two, three, four. Arm. Team Red. Team Red, get in. Team Red, get in. Bang. Roger. Select Team White. Sign Team Yellow. Five, six, Five, seven, eight, nine, and six, six, eleven, twelve. Arm. Team Yellow. Seven. Ready. 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 Sign Team Blue. Five, six, seven. Select Arm. Team Blue. Team Blue, get in tank. Roger. I also have uh, some profiles in the or uh, combination orders in the profile. Uh, that basically means that uh, the units will be set to what they're most useful uh, useful in. For example, you you have uh, two main profiles, and that uh, I mean modes, and that's armor mode and infantry mode, self-explanatory. If if the units are in a tank, you would obviously use armor mode and infantry infantry mode. So here, here, I'll show you what. Team red armor mode. Team red, you're free to engage. Team red, scan horizon. Team red, danger. Team yellow infantry mode. Team yellow, scan horizon. Team yellow, copy my stance. On these modes you also have similar. For example, I can say select team red. Select team red. Armor mode. Team red. Cover all sectors. Two. Three. Four. Armor mode. Team red. Scan horizon. Team blue armor mode. Team blue. You're free to engage. Select Team Yellow. Team Blue. Danger. Team Yellow. Go to that. Bush. Enter map. Right. Roger. Add waypoint. Exit map. Open radio. Action zero. Eight. Waiting. Select Team Blue. Sign Team Green. Eight. Seven. 